Peter Sous is next. Peter, I believe, is here. I saw him here earlier. Hey, Peter. And Peter says, my second submission for Feedback Friday. It's been over a year since my first. What did I do? I added some Rhodes, electric piano. Can't play this, but I did it anyway. Hey, that's why we can edit ourselves. Added fretless bass instead of the original one. Nice. Mixed it in Luna to try it out. It took me quite a lot of extra time to get it working. Asked for feedback on Facebook and used it to just see what people might want differently. Adjusted some of the um, adjusted most of the comments. Also to learn and become more flexible with feedback for potential clients. There's a lot more learn than just mixing stuff. Exactly. Yeah, that's very true. Curious uh, see what I could have done better, although the last one is also a taste thing, I think. Exactly. To the best community in the world, I salute you. I salute you too. Thank you ever so much. Stay safe and have fun while making beautiful music. Great. Here we go. Last but no means least is our friend Peter. Thank you, Peter. enjoyed this peter really really fantastic and what a lovely way to finish really lovely way to finish okay uh vocals wonderful what a beautiful balance between the vocal and uh, love the vocal sound beautiful balance between that and the and the harmony Someone better, better come along. I'll be waiting. <clears throat> i think my only real discussion is like electric piano bass guitar and kick all feel like the same sound to me. You know, they're very dark. I'm not, I want to hear just a bit more air on the electric. I like the darkness. I like the Riders on the Storm electric piano. Don't get me wrong, some of my favorite sounds. 
but just a little bit more high mids on the on the piano, a bit more high mids on the bass. I feel like I, when I hear a fretless, I want to hear, you know what I mean? Just a little bit more high mids on the bass. At the moment, I forget that it's a fretless until just a moment, and I'm like, was that a fretless? I wasn't quite sure. It's a tough one. You know, Jaco's um, first solo record, some of the bass tones are amazing and some of them actually aren't that good. Like they mixed him like super low midly and didn't give him enough top to hear some of the articulation. It's an amazing album, but I'd love to go back and remix some of that. It's probably of the period, you know, it's just the way stuff was done. Um, so I feel like, you know, just a little bit more openness on that bass could be really, really good. Um, so more air on the piano, more air on the bass. Give me a little bit, and I think we'll be in a really, really good shape. Otherwise, absolutely stupendous. I love the treatment of the vocal. Really, really nice. And I can hear the thump on the kick. If I bring down C4, um, let's just go in. Yeah, really nicely done. It's defined. It's all about the bass down there. Sorry, all about the kick drum down there. Really great work. What a great way to finish. Pierre, Mr. Peter, wonderful work. Amazing week. Wow. We did that in just a little bit over two hours. Not bad for us. Sometimes we go, uh, uh, sometimes we go three, two and a half. But uh, amazing time. Thank you, everyone, for joining us. We'll be back next week.